What's going on? We're in a greenhouse and um, we got some problems. My cucumbers right back there have a disease. Yeah. So the bad news is we're going to have to remove the cucumbers. The good news is, is um, so far I haven't found it on any of the other plants in here. So um, it's either downy mildew or it's mosaic virus. There's so much information online to try and diagnose cucumber plants and diseases. It's like this crazy deep rabbit hole and some of the symptoms I have look like mosaic virus some of the symptoms I have look like downy mildew either way um, I'll show you what we're working with here and um, we're gonna have to tear the plant out okay so here is the cucumber plant and we have three vines out of the soil one two three this vine here is completely infected see look at that and then as you move up the plant you see it's doing that and then it just gets worse so it's come up there we've grown a sucker right out and it's in there too so we are going to have to cut this entire vine out and then we are going to have to untangle it from up in there so let's see if we can get a good image under the light there for you guys so that's see and they're they're downward cur downward curled leaves which made me think it was mosaic virus so that's unfortunately what we're dealing with and you know why that really sucks because we're actually getting into growing cucumbers now see right we're getting cucumbers growing so we've got a bunch here so I mean you know we've got them starting all over so unfortunately we're definitely taking this vine out and hopefully the other two plants are okay um but i will definitely be having to keep an eye on them so because we're already starting to see see now that's one of the old that's the oldest leaf on that whole vine so it may just be an old vine and the plant's just kind of shutting off energy to it or it's an old leaf the plant might be shutting energy to it so we'll see but i'm gonna have to we're definitely gonna have to take this one out. So before we go cutting that out, also just wanted to mention, I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but that disease has gone this far in four days. That's how fast this is moving. So I need to get it out of here one way or another. So I got a bucket and we're just going to start taking this apart. It's all clipped up, see? We've got clips holding on, so uh, I'm just going to start peeling off clips, and then we're just going to cut this out. What a shame, eh? What a shame. All right, so basically I'm just going to start right off at the ground, and I'm going to chop that bottom vine right off. Actually, I'm going to pull that vine out of the ground. basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut off pieces in between all the clips so that way I can just pull them out section by section by section.
Well, that's a shame, eh? This cuke only needed a day or two more and it would have been ready. Look at that. It's almost like a little gherkin. Another little tiny cuke. What a waste, eh? Now the fun part. I'll show you what I'm talking about here. Look at this. So that vine there that I cut is all tangled all up through here. Look at that. So I'm gonna have to pick all that out. This will be interesting. Okay. Well, that could have been worse. So there's the end of it. There's another lost cucumber. Well, while we're in here, we might as well harvest some, right? Look at that. Bam! We're eating fresh cukes anyways. So, okay, well, that's that. And let's hope that all the rest of those cucumbers, let's drop this down here a little bit so I can bring you back in close. So let's just hope that whatever that is, was not what was affecting the rest of the plant. And it's over here too. So I have a feeling that there is something in this soil and that's what got my plants sick. Cause I don't see any aphids. I don't see any other issues. Uh, it's well watered, it's well fed. So, I don't know, let's hold it. Let's just hope it hangs on. And then I guess what I'll do, look at this, it's shooting up into my ceiling here. So I guess what I'll do is I'll just take this and turn it around and just send it back down again. So, well guys, that's, uh, that's this one. I always show you guys the, the ups and the downs. I mean, 
we're literally dealing with nature here and sometimes it has different opinions. I wanted it to grow cucumbers and it wanted to catch some sort of disease. So I've got a bucket of chopped up cucumber bits on the ground. Those are going in the green bin. I'm not keeping them on site here. And now we're down to two cucumber vines. Sometimes you don't win. Sometimes you do win. Today, we didn't win. But on the plus side, I've got three beautiful cucumbers for my dinner. So, you know, when something like this happens, you got to find the shiny side of things. So, that's it. All right, guys. Grow good food. Have a great day.